and now last time 10 years ago i was a senior account manager in an advertising company five figure income and then i found love in doing what i'm doing right now sharing uh, islam the purpose of it's not so much about money bro you just imagine ben this is a weekend people are spending time with their families i can do the same thing too why i want to spend my precious time standing here talking to strangers do i get any money no i don't get some people may say oh, no 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 every, every single person they say uh, they talk to you know uh, some people will pay them money no nobody but because i found the purpose of life the meaning of life the enjoyment of life the tranquility in life i just want to share with people people gonna accept it or not i can't force because in islam i can't force people to accept islam main thing is that i talk to you ben if you're interested to find out i share more with you and then let's explore together we could be different faith right now you know but that doesn't mean that we cannot talk to each other that, that's the thing i like because I, I like because a lot of times we see especially in malaysia because of the politics christians and muslims always fighting all this nonsense but i don't believe it has to be like that like like saying the same way i'm talking to you yeah now, yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. I, I i love hearing your story yeah because then it, it helps me understand there could be a one million for those for those right? hopefully hopefully you know, out there <laughs> yeah but just maybe nobody understands so it helps me as a christian also to understand your journey yep. you know and, and i totally agree with you because a lot of the teachings with islam and christianity is almost similar yep. you know of course talking about jesus uh, just the different way we approach is different yep you know that's why i just find it so interesting and i like hearing your story and, and yeah I, 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 I involved yeah. in interfaith yeah. as well and uh, I, I mentioned a lot of time in interfaith i say the problem that we have we put aside all the politics right? yeah okay if you ask politician not to politicize things just the same way that you are asking the footballer not to play football yeah. okay yeah. <laughs> impossible <laughs> impossible you ask politician stop politicking so what are going to they, do? They, what are you asking them to do now they got no job <laughs> they got no job <laughs> you know politician is to play politics yeah, yeah, yeah. In the interfaith, I, I mention this, I say, the problem that we have today is not because we have different faith. Mm. No. I say, throughout history, Muslim and Christians and Jews, wherever Muslim go, okay, we can coexist and live together peacefully. You know what's our problem today? I say, we as a religious leader, I say, I say to all the religious leaders, right in front of the chief minister of Sarawak, I say, the problem that we have today is because we say something in front of the crowd and when we go back to our congregation, we say different things.